Cool, I found a new beach. I've just never been here before. But I wanna come check out this new snorkel spot. It's really interesting to see all of the people from all over the world coming to Hawaii. There's so many people here. You really get exposed to so many ways of being and people not even using their brains. And you know what? I don't think they can't. I think people are totally drugged and brainwashed. Hardcore. And they don't know it. They're, they need to cleanse. Everybody needs to go on like a detox cleanse. And you need to stop using all these horrible chemicals in, in, the, in the products that are being produced. It should, that should be illegal. I mean, fluoride in our water, GMOs, all the pesticides, all the pharmaceuticals, all the over-the-counter drugs. People are just like not human anymore. Literally, like they've been detached and that's all on purpose. We are being drugged on purpose. I know for me, I could tell, gosh, it's almost been, it's almost been 20 years like 23 or 17 years that I know it was like, I need to cleanse. My body was like reacting so harshly. And, and ever since I cleansed, it's like you get clarity of mind, you get clarity of emotion. Hey. Um, so it's extremely important, especially right now. People like are not even using their brains. And I think it's because they're so toxic they're so their body is just so ruined by all of these like they're not natural I, you know look, I wanted to say like environmental but they're not environmental they're all man-made poisons and they are being used on us on purpose to make us weak to make us sick like they want the whole Google Earth to be patients they want everyone to be a patient of Google Earth Everybody just be sick. Everybody just be dependent. Everybody be, just give up your mind, give up your body. This has been going on for so long. And I always, not always, but almost, I always knew that it was bad. But I figured, you know what? If people are stupid enough, then whatever. But I didn't know that they were gonna like try to enforce it on everyone. Now it's a whole other ball game. And really, you know, it was, I was just starting to learn about things like, like how they're putting aerosols into the air that are chemicals. Like they're literally just trying to dumb down humanity to make this shift. I think they've been working on this for a long time because when I look around and I see these people, they're, they're, not, they're not using their potential. They're not using their capabilities at all. And they all just kind of like, they all just act like a little bit like of a TV show. Like, I feel like so many people that I see are, 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 their personality has taken on some program that they've watched or that they like or some famous person that they like. They like are constantly copying. People aren't really connected to themselves anymore and it's all because of all the drugs. It's all these massive chemical warfare we've been experiencing quietly. It's like a silent weapon. And now with the Wi-Fi, people are just like, Bleh. people are like, done like they don't even get it they don't know as long as they can take good pictures and I, I really am not sure how people can be satisfied in that life to be honest with you um, I just I feel way too much to desire to be numb but a lot of people are I mean who knows how many people are actually on these like psychotic medications I don't even know that number. I'm gonna look but I always forget about that. Like I, I assume, I always think people are like me, you know, they're healthy, good intention, working on themselves, working on the world, sacrificing, you know, stupid stuff to, to choose what's real and good for humanity. And then I meet people and I'm like, oh gosh, I'm wrong. <laughs> A lot of these people don't really care. And they're just like, give me some pills, 
give me some stimulants, give me some entertainment, a few pictures, and I'm done for. I don't really care. So many people are like that. And it's just because I think the constant inundation of drugs and bad vibes, it's just disconnecting people from who they are. So people need to talk, detox, really, really bad. That's what's going to be in my third book a lot more is about how to eat and the rhythms of a natural life cycle, the rhythms of a natural diet. That's really important too. I see all these people eating steak at night and I'm just like, well, that's just going to go sit in your colon and rot all night. Like People don't even realize you're not supposed to eat meat at night. You're supposed to be eating fruit at night, vegetables. You're going to be eating gnarly stuff like animal products you got to eat it during the day your body your body's not even going to understand like they've created a whole society to fuck you up basically they want you to do everything the opposite of what you should be doing because that's when you're going to be weak you don't understand that there are people that really are weird and they want to hurt people they want to control people and they're doing it i saw jp sears say that you know, it's not even about making money, it's about control, and I think that's totally true. I think control is even more satisfying than having money to some. I, I think it's all weird. I personally became a renunciate like 17 years ago, like I was saying. You know, I just was like, ah, I got a divorce, so I was able to finally just like make a clean cut and make all my own choices. And I was just like, great, I don't want any of this shit. And I was just like throwing out the baby with the bath water. And my mom was like, wait, you need some stuff. And I'm like, nope, don't need anything. And you do, <laughs> you do need stuff, but not that much. Totally changed my direction in life, my purpose, my goals, my energy, my health, my vibration. And I'm happy, you know, I don't have to surrender to anything, I, you know, now I'm facing more things than I never thought I'd have to like the rest of us, but generally I've made choices so that I don't have to be in chains. I don't need millions of dollars. I don't need a bunch of fake shit. I don't wear makeup. I don't color my hair. I don't use, uh, I don't obviously get plastic surgery. Um, I don't paint my nails. I don't get waxed. I basically am like a natural human being. I don't need a billion dollars because it's not in balance. I need things to be in balance. That's what my heart tells me. So all these other people with all these other goals and intentions, it's all coming through like brainwashing and mass media and like all this fake television stuff. Like not even really letting people just be natural human beings on this wonderful earth. Just enjoying nature and eating food and having that simple simpleness that's what I got back I got back simplicity and it was the greatest thing in my life and when we get there then no one's gonna control us anymore let's do it